still raining. This idea is not about raining and not about peeing. I was um, I was thinking about kids having secret languages, you know, and we haven't seen yet in the Squashbuckler Diaries the actual friends that Joy has. When Justin disappears, he wakes up, he's gone. She, she doesn't know he wakes up. He's just gone for most hours of the day and night for her. Uh, she sleeps during that time, but that's not enough. She spends most of her time without him. And so she has friends in the belly of Bonnie's Revenge, the pirate ship they, uh, uh, they live on. There's an infinite corridor, an infinite jail, you know, uh, where they put all the bad guys who stay when Justin wakes up, uh, who remain behind. And some of them become Joy's best friends which will be very important for the story, you might get, you might guess. Um, so, she takes one of those bad criminals and tries to te teach him or her, I have to decide who it is, uh, a secret language that only they understand. And if that bad person is, a uh, bad creature is... Uh, really serious and still very bad or doesn't get it, I think it could be really funny. That's what I think. I think trying to teach uh, a villain a secret language is, uh, for fun, is, uh, is a good idea for Squash Buckler Diary because that's how Joy spends most of her days. Have a great day. Enjoy. Bye-bye.